just in there watching some uh, clips on YouTube and um, I was watching something that was kind of interesting to me and a certain somebody named you know who was showing something that he seen in the antique store it just made me go hmm have I never filmed this before and I've never showed y'all my toolbox for my rat rod well, let me just get it out of here and show it to you. This is the one I've been carrying around ever since I built this rat rod, ever since I started driving it, taking it to car shows and whatnot. And it is a handy, handy <coughs> toolbox, a blue diamond, it says. And um, so I was watching that video, and it just made me think of this, and I thought, well, I guess I, maybe I never have showed it. I thought I had, but, but it's worth, uh, it's noteworthy. It's worth showing this toolbox. And it's what I carry in my rat rod at all times. And we got a few necessities in here. You know, we got this extra, extra uh, uh, fuel filter, and of course, a couple screwdrivers, crest wrench pliers, and a flashlight. And uh, when I first started out with them uh, barbed wire uh, uh, plug wires, I wasn't real sure if the coil wire was going to clear without arcing. Uh, I did put a boot on it, but I was carrying one extra wire here just in case something didn't work out on that, but I can, I don't need that anymore, but one thing you always do need in your toolbox is a little bit of red Loctite. I got a various uh, nuts and bolts and, you know, little things and a knife here, and, uh, and uh, but this is the most, probably the most important. Oh, wait a minute, it's not in there. There's some wiring. I had to borrow a piece out of there. I'll go get it and put it back because there's one, one uh, ingredient there that is absolutely ne necessary for your, uh, well, where is it? What have I done with it? There it is. There's the thing that goes in that toolbox. It's absolutely necessary. Is, uh, is this right here. And what it is, is, uh, is some bailing wire you've got to have if you got a Chevrolet an old Chevrolet you've got to have some bailing wire so I always carry some bailing wire in my, in my toolbox and I usually have an old rag in there but anyway that's all I just saw that video and it made me think of my toolbox so I thought I'd uh, come out here and take a little picture of my little handy Andy uh, toolbox so that's all thanks for watching see you later bye